No? Uh, next, please. Is a new healthcare mode, I mean, a, a, a strategy to change the nature of the care, the healthcare, that is very important, and to adopt on this perspective another management mode uh, with social effectiveness more than economical efficiency. And a public control on the public-private relationships. That's very important to be able to control the market <laughs> dynamics and to be able to have technological independence. No? So we are trying to go ahead and uh, to make uh, an empowered no? uh, industrial complex for health because we need to provide our own uh, drugs and technologies, whatever, to support the, the global costs of a national health system. No? And of course, we have a lot of uh, illusions about to, how to, to make it through uh, an alliance with countries as India, South Africa, and others that could uh, provide a combined capacities for, for that. No? We are doing that as, I don't know if you, if you noticed that uh, Brazil gave to, to Africa uh, an industry for anti-retroviral drugs that was installed now in Mozambique. Uh, to produce antiretroviral drugs for all this, the southern Africa. And uh, these initiatives, I think, is, is very important to, in order to understand this third world approach no? and to generate another kind of, uh, of, of cooperation. And those are this, the five fronts of social inclusion where we understand health is part of that, but it's necessary to work with, with all those dimensions connected to. Otherwise, our initiative to have universal health systems could be understood as quite naive, no? because it could be considered as an isolated uh, question and not something connected to, with the, the concept of development. So the universalization of public policies in general, including education, social security, is a broader perspective, the taxes policies in order to be progressive, fair, the transfers of richness and the universal income, no? that's something very important to consider, the strengthening of the participative democracy and democratic institutionality, and the promotion of job quality, safety, and income level is something very important as well as combined initiatives no? that could be really considered as a global initiative uh, about the redistribution of richness. So I, I ask your uh, pardon to, for this very compressed presentation, but there's quite a lot of things to say in a very short time. And I, I will be ready for the debate. Thank you. Thanks, Armando, for trying to cover a, <clears throat> a very large area in a short time. And perhaps there are many more things that we would like to discuss which can come up in the discussion.